Hello, I'm Shannon Bisgard. This is an exciting time for the Limbar community as we continue to work to provide new learning opportunities for our kids and move forward with a plan to address capacity issues in our schools. We listened to your concerns following the disappointing outcome of last year's bond vote and we went back to the drawing board. The result is a fiscally responsible 10-year capital plan that leverages all available funding streams to strategically address existing and future capacity issues at all grade levels in our rapidly growing area. This plan also places a strong focus on efficiency, safety, and security improvements for each of our buildings. Work has already begun. This summer using Pepple and SAVE funds, renovations at the historic elementaries, which were included in last year's bond, will resolve safety and building code issues. Still, capacity remains the primary challenge facing our district. That's why on September 11th, we will ask district residents to go to the polls again to consider a new proposal that will fund the construction of two buildings for grades five and six. By moving the fifth graders out of the elementary buildings and the sixth graders from the middle schools, we will create valuable class space in nine of our buildings that will allow for enrollment growth well into the future. There is no doubt that our district will continue to grow. We all see it every day with new housing developments popping up everywhere across our district. Next year's graduating class represents our only class with fewer than 500 students. We also anticipate seeing the largest kindergarten class ever. And in the next few years, our middle schools and three elementary schools will be over or very close to capacity. When I came to Limar in the 2003-2004 school year, we served the needs of more than 4,800 students. Now that number has grown to an astonishing 7,700 students, an increase of 59% in just 15 years. Current projections predict that this trend will continue across the district. Recent renovations at the high school have added more learning spaces and improved traffic flow in the building, increasing capacity there. We will also continue to utilize the Learning Resource Center, or LRC, for additional class space as needed. But the need remains at our middle and elementary schools. As you have likely noticed, fifth graders at Indian Creek Elementary are already in portable classrooms because the school has run out of space. A positive vote in September would allow for construction of two fifth and sixth grade buildings in areas of our district that are seeing significant residential development. One would be built east of Echo Hill Elementary on Echo Hill Road. The second would be constructed on 35th Avenue, where it will eventually connect with 44th Street on the northern edge of Marion. The two five, six buildings would provide approximately 68 new classroom spaces to handle enrollment growth for years to come. Learn more about our grade restructuring plan and bond campaign at our vote webpage, which can be found at www.linmar.k12.ia.us. And please vote on September 11th. Thank you.